gentlemen out there that are more than happy to help us. Well, I hope you have some luck with that. Tell you what, half a cup of apple juice, and I'll be done. Okay, good luck. Thank you. Perfect. 
Well, you're a little flat, but you know, I've been quilting and I got some bearing. That should work it out. Oh, yeah. Now, you know how much we appreciate this. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Yeah. 
things, and I want the kids to see them. I just fell in love with them for my kitchen. Aren't they beautiful? Yes, very nice and yeah. them. Yeah. Don't they be great in my kitchen? Nice and well, let's, sunny. Let's really see what they look like. You know, put your arms back out. Where's your people walk? <laughs> let's do trip. That's my favorite. get-togethers, gatherings, 
times that, that you use this wonderful kitchen facility that we're sitting in? For Beach Grange is different. So they have different activities. Uh, Golson itself has an annual appreciation for the neighborhood around the holidays. We'll fix a big turkey, a big ham, all the Christmas fiction things for that dinner. Everybody's invited again. It does not cost anything. Santa comes in for all the kids. Everybody gets a prize. We just right. had an Easter egg on here. Sounds like a lot of fun. It is. It's a lot of fun. It is a lot of fun. And we, our biggest things that we're proud of are things we do for the kids, like the Easter egg hunt and Santa Claus. And, and we have a troop of Boy Scouts to come in and help us at Easter with the kids. And I, it's good for them, it's good for the kids, and it's good for the adults. And one thing you noticed when you were walking around, we also have a community library here. And uh, another thing we do is food for Lane County for needy families. So you're part of the Food for Lane County? Yes, yes we are. And we're also uh, an American Red Cross emergency shelter. So in case of an uh, emergency or anything. Uh, All of the people in this community can come here? Can come here as a shelter. Mm -hmm. That's wonderful. Yeah. It's good to know. I'm glad that we're going to be able to get this out to the community. Our headquarters are actually headquartered and we own the building in Washington, D.C down in the Capital District. Mm -hmm. Our state office is right across from the state capitol in Salem. Um, I believe there's, I hate to quote it because I'm not positive. I was just told the other day it's 40, I believe it was 47 states still have ranges. Wonderful. Yeah. So, you know, we're really looking forward to an upsurge. If people really understood what we do and that we're based on, on community service and bringing together people, you know, and we don't care what their politics or religions are, let's just bring everybody back together and let's be communities again, you know, and help each other. And I think that's the bottom line. We want to better ourselves and those that live in our community. Awesome values and ideals. Yes. It, that's why we belong to it. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else about the Grange that you would want the viewers to know? The only thing I would ask them is to look around their communities, find that range, find an activity, because almost all range activities are open and free to the public. Go and find out yourself. Go and talk to those people. You know, and go to their play festival, go to a potluck if they have one or an open house. Go and see what kind of people are in your neighborhood, and I think they'd want to belong also. The more ideas, the better we can serve. And there's no one person that has all the right ideas that cover everything. You know, everyone's limited to uh, our own personal knowledge. Uh, you might like one thing, I like something else, Judy cares for something else. If you don't get together, you can't share these things and expand on activity. And that's what we desperately need, is more involvement to expand on activities to serve the community community service. Anybody needs help that we can, we do. And we need more people, period, to, to come and become active, to, uh, to be involved. And like I said earlier, uh, there's a lot of things we don't know, we miss. You know, just like in this conversation this evening, you have thoughts, she has thoughts, but if we don't put it on the table and discuss it, how can we reach? Communication is key. It's key. It's key. Uh, there might be somebody down the street that out of work, no food. We're here to help. There's, as you notice, when you walk around here, there's clothing. Come and get it. And books. And books. I like that. Come and yeah. get it. Yeah. The, the library is actually a separate entity from the Grange. The Grange leases that room to the library. But the library has worked hand in hand with the Grange, so we're able to offer more as, as the library you know, can offer more, the Grange can offer more by working together. And that's, you know, the more we can work together with those other entities in the community, the more we can give back to our community. To serve the community. Awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you for inviting us here. You're more than You're more welcome. welcome. I hope you enjoyed the comedy festivity. It was wonderful. There was a lot of people laughing. They very much enjoyed the play. Yes.
2379 Highway 36 on the way to the coast. If anybody has any questions, they're free to contact me. My name is Judy Kay. My number is 998-2093. I'd be happy to answer any questions covering the Grange and what we do. Another number you could call would be Roberta Sellers, 998-8794. Or you could just call Les Barbershop and ask for Alex. <laughs>